hey guys my name is sharon and you're welcome to my channel in today's video i'll be doing a um, motivational cleaning video please stay tuned and watch to the end kindly um so uh, it's on monday we've just had breakfast so i decided um to film this video i like to do extreme cleaning on mondays um so we, we've just had breakfast and i'm now washing uh, the utensils used for breakfast So after I'm done cleaning the utensils, I'm going to kind of soak my sink. I use Vim, then scrub and leave it to soak for maybe 20 minutes. Then I rinse. So here I'm just scrubbing. Yeah. Once I was done uh, scrubbing the sink, uh, now I'm now putting a little bit of water and vinegar which I put in the microwave to heat for uh, like 5 minutes then leave it to uh, steam the microwave. Just put water and vinegar. Then after it has steamed, I now wipe the inside of the microwave with a serviette and it's all clean. Okay, for my cooker, I use a towel with... I dip a towel in uh, water that has uh washing powder and uh, a little bit of jig yes so i just wipe wipe down everything then i'm going to wipe again with the towel from clean water clean plain water so this towel has clean water i just wipe down just to make sure everything comes off the oils in the maybe food that has stuck 
for this i do every day i wipe my cooker every day then I also wipe the walls around the cooker just to make sure there's no oil that splash while maybe frying frying food or something yeah and also under the countertop I don't know if you can see guys from this tissue uh, there was some dirt it's like food there was some dirt from the microwave once it has steamed that dirt comes off so you just go in with a serviette and that's all The countertops it's the same i just go in with the towel that has soap water and that's it up here there is no much dust it's constantly washed cleaned i mean dusted so i was just going in to make sure it's like completely clean
So after I was done cleaning the kitchen, I came to take out my curtains so that I can wash them and they were quite dusty so I had to wipe the rods and the, wash the curtains as well. The curtains I only used uh, washing powder and while, while rinsing I used a uh, downy and that's all. The advantage of having this machine is that I got to wash them and dried them in a span of like two hours I had my, my curtains back at the windows. So this is the kitchen, the, the curtain at the kitchen, um, it, it was so dirty, especially around where the tap is, so I had to go in again with, I had to hand wash it around where the tap usually is, yeah, and make sure it's clean. So vile nilifanya nilikuwa nataka kwanza nizioshe zote alafu nizikamue zote at once since uh it tap inaingiza maji pole pole while zina zinaoshwa nilikuwa na collect maji mingine kwa bucket just to save on time so i'm done with the shears no i'm niko kwa curtains na actually ju nimeeka zote nilirudi kuzitoa cuz they are so heavy so <laughs> I only washed kidogo kidogo and you appear in Ari.
while the curtains are washing nilikuja kupanguza kiti so for the seat because uh, iko na stains za chakula cuz hapa ndio huwa na feed mtoi <laughs> so what is this iko na stains za chakula so nilikuwa tu na kitu ya ku scrub imagine iko na omo so nilikuwa tu na scrub alafu na panguza na kitamba haina soap so hizo stains zote za chakula zilitoka So huwa natoa covers once in a while si kazi rahisi but nilikuwa nimezifua uh, December ikianza na leo na sasa tuko January so azija kama more than a month na already ziko na stains za chakula but it's because of the baby yeah before we invest in a vacuum cleaner this is how i clean my seat <laughs> Now the curtains are all clean like they've been washed it's now to rinse so as i told you nilikuwa na collect magic kwa bucket as they were washing now it's only to to rinse them and to dry and that's all then i put them back kwa windows while they were washing after i was done with the seat i went to clean the windows i think you've seen a clip up on bele i was cleaning the windows
so my curtains are dry like dry dry and um, the only thing remaining because rudisha quadration hands up to the people who do motivational cleaning videos like this work is not easy i thought i could clean the whole house and record but by this time my back was aching i was so tired yeah so it's actually i'll <laughs> I didn't get to shoot everything but I I cleaned almost the whole house so in the next video I'm going to show you how I clean my bathrooms and uh, maybe bedroom I don't know because after I put back my curtains uh, my battery died so I didn't record while cleaning the floor and that's pretty much it So at this point I made sure my machine is clean, I dried it and left it to dry, to air dry. So at this point I'm, I'm rinsing my machine just to make sure there is no dirty water trapped in it and also to remove those soapy stains. Yeah, so nilikamua tuna maji safi and that's it. Then I left it to air dry. the whole house is clean by this time i was done with everything uh, just to put the curtains back kwa windows uh, yeah so uh, let me know how what you think about this video please comment down below and uh, like this video it wasn't actually it wasn't easy filming this video so please give it a like <laughs> and subscribe if you've not That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Please stay tuned for another cleaning motivational video. Yes, and that's it. I'll see you on the next one. Bye, guys.